Hello, I'm Mike Russell from musicradiocreative.com. You want your podcast to comply to loudness standards? Well, I'm pleased to say in this Waves audio mini-series where I'm looking at Waves audio plugins, I've got the perfect plugin for you to do just that. Before we get into it, make sure you like this video, also subscribe and ding the bell so you never miss another video from me. Today, we're looking at this beautiful plugin from Waves Audio uh, that measures loudness not only in the short term, but also the long term as well, and gives you instant feedback on whether you're hitting loudness standards, not only for podcasts, but YouTube videos and more. You'll actually see when I unfold the presets menu here, there are a load of very relevant uh, stuff, obviously the old standards from broadcast, uh, but we got podcast and music, minus 16 luffs is what we're aiming for there. If you're going on YouTube and Spotify, minus 14 luffs. And look at that right here at the bottom, some Mike Russell presets as well. You might want to go and check them out. There's actually the Mike Podcast Loudness uh, preset included in this Waves plugin. And if you want to get this plugin at 10% off, use my link mrc.fm forward slash waves. That is mrc.fm forward slash waves waves and it's really good now i know adobe audition that i'm using right now has its own loudness tools but if you're using audacity or something else this is going to be invaluable in your toolkit uh, so i might click the mic podcast loudness and let's just give it a go really what we want to be getting is a tick in the long term for minus 16 luffs let's play this audio back i created this trailer to welcome you to what will be my podcast oh look at that which for anyone Nearly. unfamiliar oh. is an Nearly. episodic yes. form of internet radio that will be available on demand in which my visitors and subscribers will be able to conveniently access anytime via a variety of computer and mobile platforms and there we go. Uh, we're, we're almost there. We're at minus 17. So I probably just need to push up the gain. Don't need to worry about any of the other controls, uh, just the gain. So I'm going to just push that up just ever so slightly. I created this trailer to welcome you to what will be my podcast, which for anyone unfamiliar is an episodic form of internet radio that will be available on demand in which my visitors and subscribers will be able to conveniently access anytime via a variety of computer and mobile platforms. And there you go. You can see the short term is changing all the time uh, and updating and giving you a tick when you're in that range. That's always going to be changing. But the main thing we're concerned with is the long term loudness. And with the Mike Russell podcast loudness preset, we're at minus 16 for this short clip. Obviously, you can do it over a longer podcast of 30 minutes. And if you were to do a 30 minute podcast, I'd advise just play 30 seconds into that plugin. And if you hit the minus 16 target within 30 seconds, I'd say it's pretty ideal. And all I had to do when I loaded this preset was just simply increase the gain from 2 to 3 dB plus and that's it I'm now hitting the loudness standard I can apply this boom I can save this file out and that is completely podcast ready to upload as an mp3 file to my podcast host it's really as easy as that the WLM plus loudness meter you can get it with a 10% discount using my link at mrc.fm forward slash waves and the best of luck using this if you have any questions about loudness at all do feel free to post them in the comments down below